my name is Vanessa and this is the Pegasus Touch leveling tutorial. You will need levelers, a build plate, fat, a 2mm and a 2.5mm hex key, and a flathead screwdriver. First you're going to slide the vat into the printer. It should enter smoothly but will not sit securely. Use a flathead to secure the four corners of the tray. Tighten enough to keep the tray in place but do not over tighten. Next you must attach the build plate. Loosen the screw to ensure the head moves all the way back on the printer. Once in place, tighten the screw ensuring it's secure. There is no need to over tighten as you will be removing the build head regularly to remove your prints. Close the lid to access the functions on the screen. From the screen, go to your settings in the upper right hand corner. Calibrate motor and accept. Run the motor down and leave enough space to place the levelers. On the vat, align a leveler under each corner of the build plate. Run the motor again until the plate almost touches the levers. By using the threads in the back of the machine, move the plate down until it touches one of the levelers. Go around to each corner and loosen or tighten screws adjusting the vat level. Ensure each level touches the plate with no gaps. You want the plate to be flush, but not to apply pressure. Repeat on the remaining three corners. The back two will use a 2.5mm hex key, while the front two will use a 2mm hex key. Run the motor back up to remove the levelers. Bring the print head back down, stopping just above the vat. Complete the motion by hand. Go ahead and check that the four corners of the plate lie flush with the vat. When you can be sure that the plate and the vat are parallel, set the motor homing from the screen. Test the motor homing once to lower the vat. Run the test again to complete a full cycle. Once the test is complete, you are ready to print. 